Hi guys, in today's tutorial I will show you how to make a glitchify transition effect easy with just one mask. Let's begin. Select first clip and duplicate it, then grab a rectangle tool and mask like that. Now apply glitchify plugin on duplicated layer. Expand image glitch and toggle it off. Then expand color glitch and toggle it off as well. Expand channel glitch, channel split and channel scale. Under a channel scale check vertical and change offset and speed multiplier to zero. Bump up scale just a little bit until it's cool to you. Then expand advanced, channel scale and check fill gaps. Now let's fix the mask edges and make it smoother. Press F on a keyboard and bump feather to around 80 maybe. That's better, and now make sure to change glitchify amount to zero and then click on stopwatch icon. Now scroll to the end of a first clip and then bump up glitchify amount until it's enough for you. In my case 21 looks fine, now press U on a keyboard to reveal created keyframes and then select both and press F9 on a keyboard to easy ease them. Then go to graph editor, right click here and select edit speed graph and make a smooth curve. Let's quickly check it. First part is ready, now we have to make the same thing with the another clip. First duplicate it, then grab a rectangle tool and mask the same way. Instead of applying glitchify and adjusting it from zero, I will simply copy it from the first duplicated clip and paste on another one. Once you have pasted, make sure to press U on a keyboard and delete those keyframes, because we are going to create new ones. At the very beginning of a second clip, make sure to increase glitchify amount until you will be satisfied with it. 25 seems fine to me, now click on glitchify amount stopwatch icon and then scroll to the end of the layer and change glitchify amount back to zero. Let's select both keyframes now and then press F9 on a keyboard to easy ease them, then go to graph editor and make a smooth curve. Let's quickly check it. Nice, we are done, just make sure to fix the mask feather here as well and we are ready to go. That looks better and smoother. Also I enjoy adding glitchy shake as a transition happens. I will skip shake tutorial because I have already made a glitchy shake transition effect and you can find it under this video's description. Also I have made 16 advanced shake presets that you can get from the link in the description. Check how it looks like with the shake effect. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.